Hello YouTube people, hello world, um, this is my first attempt at a video, excuse me if it's muffled, excuse me if the quality is shit, I'm sorry. Um, I'm here to rant, discuss, put out there, uh, the forthcoming marriage of Stephen Fry and his uh, soon to be husband Elliot Spencer is his name who is 27 okay so I got up this morning I was in a good mood I read Yahoo News which by the way no one should really read <laughs> some of the comments left and the, the journalism used is disgusting um, this particular article was celebrity news Stephen Fry engaged to be married to 27 year old um, toy boy um, lover they used in their description now first of all there's some sick sick people out there we know this now I think you know the internet um, all the social media there is some sick twisted people who leave comments out there you're just nasty nasty people um, my video here is to say first and foremost why the hell can people not just be happy for other people who are happy be happy for them for fuck's sake um, I'm going to try not to swear some of the comments were just filthy uh, first of all Stephen Fry is dirty old man Stephen Fry is a paedophile Stephen Fry is this um, Elliot Spencer, I must get his name right, is a gold digger, he's a rent boy, he's disgusting, he's everything vile. Um, obviously, first and foremost, the thought of um, uh, and two people of whatever gender with an age gap having sex just revolts people, generally speaking. Um, and that I think is just you know a given um, that's the general consensus of what uh, it goes against normality and I will continue to talk about this word normality I have no idea what being normal is I've not met a normal human being yet um, I am a gay man I'll be 38 in two days and I'm one of these oddballs who um, maybe like Elliot Spencer, um, likes older men. I've only ever liked older men. Um, I knew I was gay when I was about 10. Um, mature men were always my attraction, my physical attraction. Um, I didn't have an abusive upbringing. I didn't have a horrible father. I just, in, a, in terms of what I found attractive and masculine, it was always the older guy, always. Um, and that has continued to be my way up until today. Nothing's changed. I'm not going to change my sexuality. I'm not going to change what I like and suddenly start liking people my own age or younger. I like older men. Now, that's clear. And it's been bloody difficult, let me tell you. And it's difficult at the moment living uh, as a gay man, as someone who likes older gay men. Um, it's difficult. Um, explaining it to someone I'm sick of explaining it to people um, um, the age gap relationship thing can be very difficult um, heck relationships are difficult gay straight whatever they're damn difficult things uh, most people fail at relationships you know um, that's just a fact that's a given it's great to see people out there who are still together for 20, 30, 40, 50 years and you're having a loving, happy relationship. I'm sure it's taken a lot of work. Good on you. Anyway, I'm, I'm getting away from the point. My point is, people out there, you, you're just, there's some nasty, 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 nasty people. Vile people. And... Trust me, folks, it's not Stephen Fry and uh, his, his soon-to-be husband. They're not the disgusting people. They're two people who have found happiness, 
who want to continue to be happy um, and all they don't they don't need it and they don't have to get your um, your approval of course they don't of course they don't but some of the comments I've read are just disgusting um, now I understand that you don't get it um, Crikey, it's taken me long enough to come to terms with, and, and even now I still find it difficult. Um, I, I'll be 38 in two days, and uh, my relationships and, and the men I've met over the years, um, being older, uh, I've met a lot of married men in my time. By the way, there's a lot of <laughs> there's a lot of married men out there who uh, who play about. Um, just in case you didn't know. Um, this video really I want to discuss judge the way people judge so damn quickly um, in my in my twenties I moved to Edinburgh um, and I, I I was amazed at the amount of gay men out there uh, the mature men the married men I thought everyone was at it um, when you sort of see the underbelly of what's going on if you, now, if you're a straight couple living with a couple of kids um, and you don't see what's going on around you, obviously, why would you? Um, trust me, a lot of it goes on, from saunas to cruising park areas. It happens all over the place in, in the gay community. Um, and a lot of mature men uh, turn to do that. Um, I am again straying. I'm sorry I do this. I, I'm angry. My, my brain is getting a bit fuddled. Let's get back to Stephen Fry and his soon-to-be husband. Can you not just be happy for them? Why the hell not? Um, Stephen's been through... Uh, he's been open about his lifestyle. He's been through quite a bad period. Um, I have no idea about his partner, nor will I make any judgment, because I just don't know anything about the guy, but I wish them every happiness. Now, wouldn't the world just be a little bit easier and nicer if you could just say, well done, congratulations, I hope you remain happy. Um, I, 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 I've never understood why anyone would wish ill on another person. Um, I just don't get it. I, I seriously don't get it. Um, again, going back to, I get the concept. It's hard for a lot of people to wrap their heads around. Now, I came out when I was 17. My, my close friend knew that I, that I, I liked older men. Now, a few of them, I think, just found this amusing. Not disgusting, I don't think. I don't like to think. They never... Um, they never made that evident anyway. Um, I guess they just wanted me to be happy, um, as I did of, of, of them, and, and always have them. Um, a lot of my straight friends uh, now are married with kids, and I, 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 I'm envious of that as I, as I get older. Um, I just wish that people would stop all this damn hating. Um, the, the, the social media has brought out another, again, just another reason why human nature <laughs> is so goddamn awful. In, 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 in a, it, it, it paints us in a bad picture, put it that way. If, if you were to go to the Yahoo News celebrity page right now and read the article, about Stephen um, and read the comments it's astonishing it really is astonishing um, this new word trolling um, I guess some of it is that you know just spiteful stupid comments made by ignorant people but a lot of it is genuine loathing um, genuine loathing um, now what we're talking about here remember are two adults one is 27. I don't know Stephen's age. I, I think he's late 50s, early 60s. Forgive me, Stephen, if, if you, you're uh, not in your 60s. Um, 
Now, there are grown adults who have made decisions. Now, when anything sexual or anything in, that I deem personally, in my opinion, to be wrong, is obviously when you are talking about something like paedoph paedophilia, and I'm not going to go there, when you're talking about something pre-pubescent, when, when that individual does not have choice, does not know, um, and basically they're being abused. That um, is wrong. Of course it's wrong. This is two grown people, let me just reiterate, 27 and Stephen in his 50s, who are happily announcing um, their love for each other. Um, I swear, world, we're going backwards, you know, I, 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 I thought, you know, we, we, we've been through, we went through the 60s with peace and love, uh, my generation went through the 90s with, with clubbing and with ecstasy and <coughs> um, a lot of loving and a lot of uh, understanding and, and now we get into 2015 and I, I just... It just repulses me. It repulses me. People's tolerance towards one another. We seem we seem to be becoming less and less tolerant. Maybe that isn't the case. Maybe it's just because it's more evident on 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 the internet and on social media. But I'd really like to hear your opinions, uh, Stephen and uh, Elliot. I wish you all the best. I hope it lasts. And. Um, I wish you every happiness. And I would like to hear your comments. I think it's a very interesting subject. If you've got any questions to ask me, please ask. I'm an open book. Um, if I could change the way I am right now and not be gay and not be into uh, older men in, 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 as a sexual preference, I would change that. Um, I am envious of... of uh, straight married life the, what is perceived and looked at to be normal um, I've had a very difficult time over the years and um, I'd be interested to hear your comments on the subject okay guys um, if this has been a bit waffly a bit all over the place my apologies it's my first video thank you peace and love and all that <laughs>